here we are at the Sinesta ES in Orlando, Florida, right across the street from I-360, the big old Ferris wheel, or the observation wheel. Small, well, medium-sized pool. Tables down there for me. I guess they're a breakfast buffet. The elevator, we're on the fourth floor. There's the room, hold on one. Room 463. Master bedroom window. I drive. Let's go take a look. No smoking. Just your map. Crooked uh, mirror. But whatever it works. So you come in, door, you got a sofa. Nice table, little chair, another place to sit, ottoman, on wheels, nice padded, window overlooking the parking lot, flat screen, medium size, drawers, well not drawers, shelves, this is, it's, 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 it's an extended stay, so I guess if you're going to be here for a week or so, you can put all your nonsense in there. All that good stuff. <clears throat> your dining room table. There's your, let's see, almost full size kitchen. So let's get to the master bedroom when you first walk in on your left, king size bed. And there's the window we looked in earlier. I like this because they give you outlets. Two nightstand. Right in there. Right next to your bed. I think it's the same size TV in here as there is in the living room. Some more shelves and the sink and the mirror. If anyone saw my video of the Holiday Inn in Savannah, Georgia, it's almost the same color or same stain. I don't think that's supposed to be there. I don't know if that's oxidization or. No, it's smooth. It's just, I don't know. I'm sure it's not supposed to be like that. Or maybe it is. I don't know. And then they give you a walk-in closet. There's our one piece of luggage. Extra bedding, laundry basket, safe, some drawers underneath, iron board, and an iron. For the baño, in the master bedroom. Toilet, obviously. Shower. How about we check some caulk? What do you say? <laughs> mm. Mm. So nice. 
Mm, whoever does the maintenance here cares. Really nice and white and smooth. That's like a job I'd do. Can't complain. Now, enough of the master bedroom. Master. Even when you sit, there's plugs right next to you on the bench. Beautiful. Right here, sink, garbage disposal, dishwasher, medium sized fridge. Is that an ice maker? With an automatic ice maker. Anything in the, oh yeah. Got some dishes. Yeah, you can do a little bit of cooking in here. I like that paper towel holder. I'm gonna have to take that home with me. Just a joke. I ain't stealing nothing. Nothing up in here. Uh, I don't want to see a head or something. Look at this. Got some uh, adult glasses. Mm. You got your coffee. And tea. Let's scoot this out a little. Look at PJs. Salt, pepper, sugar, Lipton tea. Very nice. Put your Proctor Silex coffee maker. Clean microwave, full size microwave. And a little two burner electric hot plate or whatever you want to call it. Nothing up there. Nothing in there. Oh, toaster. We've got ourselves a toaster. Then didn't come with that. That's just my little stash of goodies until I hit the store. Always. Cheers, my friends. Now, second bedroom. Uh, two doubles? Two twins? I don't know. Pretty big. Decent size. It's not a queen. Yeah, it's not a queen. Another TV. They're all the same size TVs. So like I said, this is the second bedroom. It's got its own sink. Hello for the second time. Not just one time, two times. And pretty decent long closet. And this is almost set up like a two-bedroom apartment. Actually, I, I guess it is. And in this second bedroom, another toilet. <laughs> and a shower. Oh, look at this. They're like getting like Disney now. They put the stuff on the wall and they refill them. And you can't steal them. They're bolted in. Hmm. Caulk job in here is also superior, my friends. Really nice place. It's amazing. The second bedroom has a pooper and a shower. And right outside the window here, what is that huge thing? Oh, the Orlando Eye. 
I-360, I don't know, there's a bunch of shops, well, restaurants, a couple bars, <clears throat> uh, Madame Tussauds or some, some wax museum, a little aquarium, pretty good place to spend some money and hang out. I'm going to show you a couple pictures and video of that thing tonight when it's all lit up. And they also have this big sky swing, I think it's 500 feet, 520, I don't know. Something stupid and crazy, I'll never go on. Another mirror, what's the place with mirrors? But all in all, to be honest with you, this room, let's get down a little sit down action. This room right here that we're in, I booked a single bedroom suite, not two bedroom. But I told them I said I wanted some type of view of the eye. So they upgraded me for free. I would have been paying around one with resort fee or hotel fee and tax and everything about 150 165 a night for Florida resident he upgraded me to this two bedroom for free because I wanted the extra view but this room here goes for 250 he said with tax and resort fee and whatever so that's really not bad 250 especially if you have two couples 125 bucks a night you're right here on I drive you don't hear nothing when you're in the room I guess it's soundproof windows, uh, restaurants, bars, all up and down and walking distance. As a matter of fact, there's a bar really right next door. Happy hour from 4 to 7. I don't know what time it is now. Check because happy, I can't be sitting here talking to you guys when there's a happy hour going on. And it's 5.42, so I'll make about an hour out of that happy hour. And it's a pretty reasonable price. Draft beer at 3 50 for after that, 14 ounce. You can't beat it. All in all, it's my first time staying here. I give the uh, the free breakfast buffet, hot breakfast buffet, you know, sausage, bacon, uh, meats, uh, I guess pastries and bagels and whatever cereal. Gonna get the money worth out of that tomorrow morning. So if anything else interesting happens, I'll let you all know. But till then, it's a pretty decent place. Hey. I'm gonna get on out of here and get me some more beers. Not the Bush Light, probably the Bud Light Draft next door. Then I'm gonna get some food and then we'll talk at you later. Till then, Randomness2375 telling you. Keep on keeping on.